So I also came across this rusty old dovetail saw and, well, how could I resist? Those suckers out. But just a bit of wiggling should come clean off. There we have it. So we're going to start again with some 120 grit sandpaper here. So with just a few minutes of sanding, we took it from looking like this to looking like this. And once we have both sides done, we can go on to cleaning up the brass, which I'm looking forward to. Brass always looks very nice when you remove that patina. I don't want to remove the dents or scratches because it's an old saw and I think they're part of the story. They add character, so I'm going straight in with 400 grit sandpaper. This wood probably hasn't been oiled in decades, so it's thirsty. You can already see it just absorbing all that oil. I have to grab my triangular file here and ever so carefully just finish sharpening every single tooth of this saw blade. Now the true test of any dovetail saw is its ability to cut dovetails. <laughs> Cut with the saw on this side of the pin instead of here so we're left with a big ugly gap but suffice to say the saw worked 